Welcome to the BPYOB channel, becoming the person that you want to be. There are five goals of this channel. For each of you who read this and subscribe to this channel, I want you to become happy, healthy, and love yourself. Two, to maximize your God-given skills and talents. Three, to improve each and every day. Four, to be able to think outside the box. And five, to achieve what seemed impossible. I ask that you subscribe to the BPYOB channel. Do you love yourself? According to Bruce Lipton, PhD, 80% of humans do not love themselves. Are you one of the 80%? Do you want to harm yourself or others? If so, immediately seek professional help. There are professionals, doctors, therapists, counselors, and our coaches who can immediately help you. Your mental and physical health only worsen if you do not seek immediate professional help. You are responsible to seek the professional help you need. Seek the professional help you need so you will be able to love yourself. You consider yourself a failure. Why? Because you did not accomplish your goal? If you strive to accomplish a goal and do not, but you learn from the experience, then you it is not a failure. If you give up, then you are a failure. You have a choice to give up or try, try again. Failures in life have failed less than successes in life. Reason, successes in life never stop trying and trying and trying to achieve their goals. If you constantly try to achieve goals, you're not a failure and you can love yourself. You consider yourself unattractive, says who? This is just one person's opinion. You can change your appearance. Show the world your best appearance possible. It starts with smiling, with excellent grooming, wearing clothes that are neat, fit well, and appropriate, being healthy by following a healthy lifestyle. Even if you have just one set of nice clothes, keep them ironed and nice looking. Note the late actor Paul Newman had one set of nice clothes when he was a struggling actor and kept them in perfect condition. Once you feel positive about your appearance, you can love yourself. Are you jealous of those who are more successful than you? Why do you consider them successful and you not? State the re reasons of writing and review them. Have you ever thought, examined what it took them to be successful? Are you willing to do the necessary steps to be successful like them? Regardless of your answers, none of us should be jealous. If you're jealous, you will not be able to love yourself because it will consume you. Do not be jealous. Have you listed your unique gifts you have? For each unique gift, have you maximized that gift? If not, start now. Develop a strategy to maximize each gift. Once you start using your maximized gifts, you will start feeling positive about yourself and love yourself. Does your life control you or do you control your life? To love yourself, you must control your life. To control your life, plan your day, your week, your month, your year. Do the following. Divide tasks into four categories. This comes from Steve Covey. Important and urgent. Important and not urgent. Not important and urgent. Not important and not urgent. You should perform the important tasks first. At the beginning of your day, allocate the time necessary to fulfill each task. Minimize the instruction, interruptions in your day. Example, the 321 plan. Three times a day, 21 minutes max for emails, phone calls. At the end of your day, unwind by having an unwinding routine before you go to sleep. Learn to relax and enjoy the journey of life so you can love yourself. Are you hard on yourself? Do you Monday morning quarterback yourself? Is your story what you tell yourself filled with revisiting your past mistakes and regrets? If you do this to yourself, you will not be able to love yourself. Remember, everyone has made mistakes and has regrets. You need to learn from your mistakes and regrets, but leave them behind and move on in your journey of life. Your story must be positive if you're going to love yourself. Are you bitter about your childhood? If you are, you cannot love yourself. You have a choice. Your childhood can define you as an adult, or you can define yourself as an adult. 
You can learn from your childhood, but you need to forgive your any hurts you received as a child. If you do not, you will be so bitter that the bitterness will consume you and you will be unable to love yourself. Define yourself as an adult. Forgive those hurts. Are you bitter at those persons who have wronged you? You have a choice to forgive and learn from those who have wronged you or remain bitter. If you remain bitter, you cannot love yourself because the bitter feelings will consume you. You have dreams of what you want to accomplish. Write them down, what you want to accomplish. Write a plan of action to accomplish each goal, each dream. Break down the time schedule to accomplish each step. And regularly review your plan of action. As the OX channel states, you're either growing or dying. If your dreams remain dreams and you're not acted upon, you will have regrets about your life and will, be, will not be able to love yourself. Print this material and regularly review it. You must love yourself for your sake. For more information, www.bpyob or bpyob, KOX, Norm Mitzapil, Norm Napoleon Hill, Sig Ziegler, Tony Robbins, just list a few videos. There are many out there. They'll help you love yourself. Goodbye, Charles Schuster, Innovation Systems, 963 LLC.